This is gonna be a long couple months. Y'all, we have, look at me with my Elvis looking hair. We have decided to self quarantine. Doing it for the safety of Colton. We just decided to put ourselves on lockdown. Ma, she talked to us and she said she thinks it's the best bet. Said if something does happen, it's so we don't get sick and give it to Colton. Because at the end of the day, you know, every decision we make is literally, Colton is at the center of that decision. So the self-quarantine is going to be the center of that decision too. But on the bright side, you guys that like daily videos, we're going to pump them out. We're going to get down to the floor and play with Colton. We're going to drive each other crazy more than likely. We're going to do a little video diary, we'll call it, of how the effects of it, of us not socializing with anybody physically other than the people in this house, how it's going to, you know, work on our psyches. And I know my psyche will go crazy being stuck completely around little mama 24-7 with no breaks. God help her. Because I get stir crazy. Cabin fever hits somebody no worse than me. But you know what? We've done it all winter. What's another couple weeks? You know, they say this could last up into August. So, you know, that would be worst case scenario. But we're still thinking about, you know, going dry land fish hunting and stuff like that. You know, it's things where you won't really encounter people in the outside world. If we see you out and I don't shake your hand or something, please don't be offended because I'm not doing it any other reason than I just don't want to bring anything home to Colton right now. Down syndrome's immune system aren't the best. It seems to be pretty good though. We're going to include you in our dinners. I'm definitely going to include you getting on little mama's nerves because I'm going to have to get on her nerves for some kind of entertainment. Oh, she's already ignoring me. What? It's, it's only been a day and she's already ignoring me. What? Oh, the fact that I'm going to be quarantined and locked down with you for like God knows how long. You'll with survive. no other human contact but you. You'll survive. Listen, I'm going to... we survive winters, okay? We're in the house for two weeks at a time. We go to the grocery store real quick, but I mean, we're in the house for two weeks at a time. Baba. <laughs> but what do you think about this? You think it's a good idea? <laughs> you do? Well, you just happy to be home with mom and daddy, ain't you? Oh, that, that's all you concerned about right there. <laughs> okay. Well, you're getting a little vocal on camera now. You trying to stand up? Hey, right there, y'all heard it. Apparently, Colton thinks this is an extremely good idea. So we'll just have to see. I don't know. I think it is. Good thing is we'll get back to the daily videos. This may actually train us into getting good at the daily videos. But I know one thing. This quarantine or not, I am not missing going and finding some dry land fish. Did you hear me? What? I am not missing going and finding dry land fish. Well, that's fine. We can do that. That'll give us something to do. Go on our property and get them. Because I know there ain't nobody up in the hills but that wood bugger. Good idea. Lord, and that dog. That's what's going to get on my nerves the most. Where are you going? It <laughs> looks like nowhere. <laughs> Bubba! Hey. Hey you! Hey! Hi! <laughs> Watching his girlfriend, Daddy. When are you gonna get the memo? Do we have to watch this again? It's better than Coca Melon, which has been on all day long. So, so you guys, would y'all hush? Zoe, stop your nonsense. I got a sty, which in our terms is a plugged eyelash hole, <laughs> if that makes any sense. No, the sty is actually a medical term for it, so. Yeah, well, it means you got an eyelash. No, uh, listen, wait, wait. I've got to get back to this Moana thing. I cannot deal with that same, like, it's been two weeks. I'm not going to be able want, to deal. We listened to Kokomo for six months, and you can't handle Moana. 
there's other things out there. He will watch more than just Moana. Y'all know what I put him through last night? I watched uh, original Snow White and the Seven Dwarves, and oh my God, I loved it. That 80 year old cartoon. Yeah. And she true. won't let me watch a movie from the 90s. I love it. But anyways, I woke up with a big beautiful sty. Here's the funny thing. I usually use Tarte foundation, you know, because my skin is real. So a lot of sunscreen and foundation will break me out, hence. Well, I ran out of my tart and just ain't going nowhere to get it right now. I just have to go without. You ain't you know? going nowhere. The other day, I just picked up a bottle of foundation at Walmart to kind of hold me over. Used it once. The very next day, woke up with this. Woke up, broke out with two big giant bumps here. One here, so, yeah. I'm doing the dishes out. You did not get enough coffee to satisfy my needs. Listen. I got enough for now. I can run low on it. Almost anything. I can survive. I'm fast, do I mean, I could have, <laughs> my body probably eat itself for a month. But, I need my caffeine. So, you're going to have to give up one. Coffee or Coke. And I ain't giving up coffee, so. I need my coffee. <laughs> say bye-bye to Coke. I need my coffee. Let's just say that. And this is the little bag you get. That's going to last us three days. That's going to last about a week. That ain't enough coffee. Yeah. Sean, on a normal basis, I need a month's supply on a regular basis. We'll be okay. A big bag. We'll be okay. Oh, you still in here happy as a bug in a rug, ain't you? <laughs> Are you serious right now? <laughs> oh, you don't want to talk to me. Now, hold on. Hold on. Now, we're going to have a talk about this Moana thing. Can we watch other things other than Moana? No. Can we? Really? You gonna stand up? You gonna take off walking? Yeah, he just, he's all Mr. Independent these days. You gonna do it again? You gonna do it again? No, you too much into it. Oh, is this your favorite song? What if I don't let you watch it? <laughs> Is that what you got to say? <laughs> and he's off. There he what? I ain't following you. You got this. You're going to have to work on your turns, man. But you know what? We're going to have plenty of time to work on your walking, your talking, your sign language. We'll be able to work on all this through this period. At least you got a diaper on to cushion your blow. Shh, don't wake the baby. Look at that dude. Shh. That was hilarious. It said is it just mine it says me versus getting up and letting my husband sleep in how quiet i am and how loud he is it's opposite for <laughs> yeah i'm like tiptoeing through the house and you're like a train wreck <laughs> so you think you're gonna get used to filming again yes i got a style on my eye y'all it's giving me a migraine listen if i had a head like yours and it didn't hurt i'd get an exam don't plan on getting uh, none for this quarantine. The attitude like that, mister. Listen, we're gonna be stuck in this house together for a long time. I got a feeling come November, December, cranberry sauce gonna come bobbling out. Open the door. That's the same time. Okay, I must have got pregnant with Colton this exact time because he was born, he's supposed to be December 15th, but he was a couple weeks early. It's November, late November, baby. Oh, God, you're right. That is history, fellas. <laughs> that is the first time a woman has told her husband he's right. I've been sitting here, y'all. I ain't got to go out in public for a minute, so I was thinking about growing my eyebrows out. <laughs> what if I wax them off? No, not, no, <laughs> boy, I'm trying to get more. My eyebrows are so thin, y'all. So I was sitting here today, I was like, that's my strangest thought for today. Like, maybe I should grow my eyebrows out and reshape them. Here is how me and little mama's on the same wavelength. My beard grows in patchy, but I was literally sitting there thinking, maybe I ought to just during this, grow my beard out and just see what it would look like. <laughs> Dude, 
dude, I'm telling you, I got out of the shower and I was, I was like, God, Megan, you need to like try to reshape your eyebrows here. Lord, okay. You're gonna look like. The quarantine brain has already set in. And this is just day one. Little mama probably ain't been out of the house in a lot. Three days. Three days. And trying to keep Turkey home and keep him. I'm just scared, man, because you know, he's got Down syndrome, so we gotta really. Okay, but wait. Through this, watch his immune system. I don't want to really focus on the virus itself. I want to just focus on the family. Share some positives, some happiness, some laughter with these folks. I don't like they're getting bombarded enough with this stuff on Facebook, on Instagram, on TikTok. Everything is literally nothing but the virus. And I would rather. Are you talking to the TV or them? No, I'm talking to them. But I'd rather just kind of take them out of it for a minute. Just, you know, share some milestones with them. Share some laughter with them. Share some fun. Let y'all inside of our heads and inside of our homes. God, will pray for you, though. They'll need a little prayer. We might class. actually get pretty good at this vlogging thing through this process. I want to try some different camera angles, some techniques, some, like, B-roll shots for the intros and maybe through the middle of the day and the outro. And I just want to try something new. Maybe even get the drone out and fly it around the house or something. Plus, like I said, we are going to go dry land fish hunting. Mainly what we're doing is isolating from people. Yeah, that sucks. I hate that too. But it's yeah. necessary. It is. That's kind of the only way we can avoid Better it. safe than sorry. Yeah. Better safe than sorry. That's all I'm going to say. I know yeah. this video was probably a little short. This is just the first one. We started late. I just had this idea, you know, me and her talked about just staying home not getting out so Heck, i told sean i was like we get stir crazy enough bored enough we'll go, go in the woods it's supposed to be 70 in the 70s three days uh either later this week or next week so you know i would probably still do some bigfoot chronicles yeah too. we'll get in the woods go for a hike take us a sandwich dry land fish hunting get bubba no, out ain't and gonna stop me from dirt. doing that because we could dry land fish hunt right back here behind the house that's the thing you guys like we can still get in the woods and hike and have picnics in the woods like you know probably be good for some of us to get stay back away in. from population i said the woods i know that's what i just said stay away from population i think it'd be good for some of us to get back in nature <sighs> for a little bit it's been I think a long this is winter be... anyways i'm sure a lot of people's craving to just be outside I think this is going to be good for a lot of people because they're going to reconnect with their families because they're not really going to have much of a choice. You can always take any bad situation and make it a blessing in life, a good thing. It's late as crap right now. She's running on E, so. <laughs> you know, it's 12 something, so I didn't think we were. I was like, he comes down with the camera on like. Well, I I'm figured sleep. we got a bad habit about not ending the videos until the next day or something like that. And, I, and I'm literally trying to get in the habit of doing this and doing this right because I, I want to do this. We we enjoy sharing our days with you guys. Yeah. You know, getting you outside of your head, even if it's for 10 to 20 minutes, you know, maybe it'll get you thinking and doing something different. But guys, I'm going to let this chick go to bed. I'm heading to bed myself. Guys, we love you. God bless you. Stay safe through all this. Yeah. And as always, stay positive, guys. Stay positive. No, it's hard right now, but we can do it. We okay. can stay positive through this. Stay country. Stay true to you. We'll see you all on the quarantine side. Bye.